Well, hello, my YouTube friends and family. So today's book of the days are the romance section, and they are two dollars a piece. Now, some of these books are just a little bit different because they may have one or two more authors with stories. So I will get to that as I go through each book. Don't forget about my giveaways for my birth month. Don't forget to mail in your postcards on time. And at the end of the month, the winners will be selected via what the postcards are sent in the names. And I wanted to let you guys have an update on the giveaway. I contacted someone through our Chamber of Commerce. So I'm waiting to hear back because... I went back through my papers and found that there was someone else besides the church I was supposed to contact because they're a director. So as soon as they contact me and let me know who the money has to actually go to, I will let you guys know where the $207 go. I'm asking them if they can videotape them um, or if it's just a receipt. But one way or another, when I get the funds in, you guys will know that that's where it went to the backpack program. I will get your receipt. <laughs> so anyways, the book of the day starting out is called Temptation Ridge by Robin Carr. And the copyright on this book is 2009. So this what the book looks like. And of course, ignore my receipt in the back. That's what it looks like. And these this book was originally $6.99. This book here is called A New Hope by Robin Carr. I have never read Robin Carr's books, but they look interesting. And this one here is 2015. This is the cover of the book. And this is the flip through. And this book was originally $8.99. So for $2, you can't beat these because these are like new. I think they might have read, been read once. So, this one here is called Ready for Romance, and this is Two Books in One by Debbie Maycomer and Finding Happily Ever After by Marie Ferrarella. So, you're getting two books in one in this copy. This is the condition of the book. Best I can show you guys and gals. And... Did I tell you the copyright on this one? Probably not. Copyright on this was 2015. And then this one here is called When Dreams Cross by Terry Blackstock. And the copyright on this was 1996. You get a little colored edging in this book. This is what it looks like. It's a bigger book. And then this one here is, okay, I do believe this is a two-in-one, too. It is. It's called Rules of Play by Nora Roberts, and the two books in here is Opposites Attract and The Heart's Victory. And this is what the book looks like, which is a very pretty cover. I love floral covers. Sorry, this is blurred. I don't know why it's doing that. But the copyright on this one is, I might be moving too fast for it, 2005. This book here, it has got a line on the bottom, is called Irresistible Forces. And I think this is another one. Let me see. Copyright is... 2004 I believe on all of them and this one here has I believe six authors in it it's winter fair gifts by Lois McMaster Bullyard Bullyard I don't know how to pronounce her name the Alchemic Marriage by Mary Jo Putney Stained Glass Heart by Catherine Acero Skin Deep by Deb Strover the Trouble with Heroes by Joe Beverly. Shadows in the Wood by Jennifer Robinson. And about the authors on page 380. So yeah, there's a list of the authors and the stories. And then this is the book. 
And of course, I love the cover because it's blue, which is my favorite color. And then this book looks really interesting, too. Um, I'm going to read the, the back of this one just because... I like this kind of book, so I think this is cool. And I was tempted to keep this one for myself. But I'm letting it go because I'm good like that. <laughs> the copyright's 2007. And this has got one, two, three, four, I believe, different author stories in it. So you're getting four in one. This one's called Dragon Lovers. Look how pretty that cover is. And then there's like a a dragon tattoo on the back of it and <laughs> this is so cool so this is what this book looks like and then of course these are bigger than your average size this is your average size book so that's why these are two a piece and it says the regular price on this was $14 Romance and fantasy collide in these enchanting stories featuring dragons and love in all their many forms. Four of today's most popular authors bring to life mythical creatures, other worlds of yesterday and today, and the passionate melding of hearts. From a virgin princess first love to a shape-changing samurai bridegroom, from a young widow and her sexy handyman secret project to a knight and his distressed damsel, the courage, beauty, and strength of dragons inspire the most unforgettable stories ever told. So that's why the scene in all these are like the same size. They're big, bigger books than your average. Just to let you know, except for the first two. Yeah, the first two aren't. The Robin Carr ones are a little smaller, but they're thicker. So there you go. And then the next book is That Certain Spark by Kathy Marie Haig. And I think this, the front of this book is so cute. 2009 is the copyright, and this is what it looks like. This was a $13.99 book. $2 a piece. You can't beat that. That's what this book looks like. She looks cute on the front. Cute and sassy. <laughs> and then the last two are hardbacks. This one here is was originally $24.95. This is Miss Julia Meets Her Match by Ann B. Ross. And the copyright on this is 2004. This is what this book looks like. And then you have this kind of a cover, which is like a cream and a blue color. This is the back. It's got a little spot right there. I don't know if that could be wiped off or not, but... Because I didn't try to. I, I did usually clean the books. But I usually wipe off the covers. I forget to take the jackets off and do them. But anyways. Sometimes I remember. Sometimes I don't. It depends on how busy I get. This is what this book looks like. And then we have. The Gil Guilted Lily. By Helen Argers. And if there's any of these that I missed that had more than one author, then I'm sorry. That some of them say and some of them don't. But I don't think. I think this is one author. And the cover of this is like a... I don't know. don't really want to say gray, but it, it, it's almost like a gray cream. I don't know. It's different looking. So that's what this looks like. We'll do a flip through. And you know what made me so proud, at least in West Virginia, is I'm the only book person I have met so far and know that has set the precedence of showing my books in my bookstore before they're sold. I don't think anybody videotapes. I'm the only one that does it. So that makes me feel good, not only as a woman business owner, but I'm pretty proud of that. So I've been told by some authors. So this is kind of cool. So there you go. And you can contact me through my Mendes Bookstore and More Facebook group or Tammy's Crafty Shop through my Etsy. You can send me a message if you have an Etsy shop so you don't feel signed in or Tammy Mind under Instagram. You can get a hold of me in so many ways. If you need an email, or just let me know in the comments and I can put an email down below too. 
but I don't think I have an email listed. I need to transfer all my information from my old phone to this one, so that's why you're not seeing the usual links because I don't have them all set up yet. But just to let you know, um, you can contact me, I believe, at Tammy's Makeup Traits at gmail.com. All ran together is one word Tammy's Makeup Traits at gmail.com. And send me a list of books. If you're interested, just put books in the title or, you know, a book order or whatever you want to title it as and send a list or if you want a book bundle. So with that, see you guys. And don't forget about my birthday prizes.